All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Oshinoko episode seven. Last episode was brutal, uh, tragic. Well, it was almost tragic. I mean, it is tragic, but it was also another level of tragic. Um, yeah, we were, we properly got a look into Akane's life, um, what she's like had to go through, what she's still going through, and because of one tiny mistake, which was barely her fault. Now the entire internet just shitting on it. Thankfully, at her lowest moments, near the end there, um, Akko was there to save her. Hopefully, he helps to kind of turn the situation around and he can help her on the show and with her public image and stuff like that. Hopefully, her confidence was stuff too. But yeah, um, God, I was just so relieved Akko was showing up at the end of the episode there. Overall, very excited for this episode. As always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh, she cares about her as well. He legit caught her in the nick of time. Given what she did, barely anything. Jesus, that's dark. Yeah, this was she was hit all at once. She wasn't ready for it. God damn, Kana. Narrowly avoided, just like this situation. Yeah, facts. Gotta distance your, how, your real self on these shows. People on the internet are fucking gross. I just realised, is Akane gonna join the group as well? That'd be cool. Poor girl, man. So wait, why is Aqua in trouble with the police? Did the situation just look really sketchy, or...? Akane for the taxi fare? Wow. Damn, bitch! Holy fuck. I get the sentiment, but did you have to slap her? Everybody here should be able- should work to get her image back. That's true, she could just pull out of a contract under these circumstances. I'm glad that it, it seems like the whole cast is actually nice, even her. I think, what, what was her name, Yuki? I'm happy that she actually cares, Rakane. Why so? True, and this, all the staff involved that published that shit without seeing the, the nice part afterwards. Wait, did he publicly re release that info? He has a plan. I don't know what the plan is, but... Interesting. I trust in his fucked up ability to make things happen, not gonna lie. Maybe 100 or so. Okay. Is this gonna, like, fuck of your contract at all? Surely the producers aren't gonna like this. <laughs> Where did the wings come from? What is with the East Island head? <laughs> wow. You <laughs> give me the foul one, Javinus. <laughs> mm, she has good knowledge about this stuff. True. <laughs> oh yeah, that's what you do. Nobody recorded that though, did they? Are we gonna fake it? Oh, so they were recording. They are even more evil than I thought then. They could have released this to make the situation better. How about I fucking kill you, bro? Huh? 
doesn't give a fuck about these kids, man. Damn. What a dick. Half your age. The way his eye just lit up. <laughs> Get on my face. I'm trying to edit. Oh, bro is dying off that caffeine. Jeez. It's probably going to do crazy, right? <laughs> They're all funny. I like them. Awkward if it just got no retweets. Yeah, it's doing alright. Damn, is that easy? Are people retweeting this shit when they probably haven't even finished the video yet? Oh god. I'm glad this shit is being shown to the public. They can all back down. 74,000 retweets. That's some buzz for the show. Even after this, there will still be haters. But, fuck him. Play a character. True. Act a bit more. You saying this in front of them, and they're all like, damn, do we actually know you? Good question. Does, does Aqua even think about girls in that way? My mother. <laughs> You're being very specific here, bro. Someone like I. Yeah. He knew I as well, of course. He knew what she was actually like. I don't know how she could even attempt to be like I, but fuck it, go for it. She's actually going to work on Aqua being her her guy on the show. She's probably smart. What's she going to do? Like wear contacts or something? She's going in with the research right now. This is kind of creepy. She might just become exactly her. Unbalanced away to get what? What the hell, I can eh? It's mo uh, it's moments like this where you remember what kind of show this is. She straight up just figured out Akane's business during her teenage years. Akane eyes, I mean. What is that on your head? Schadenfreude. <laughs> oh yeah? Interesting. Creepy. What? Oh, this has got to be really creepy for him. Oh god, she's really like her. That's creepy. I was just thinking through parts of that. Like, um... Because she was just going so in-depth about the research of I. Like, when she was sitting there. Aqua's I, like, only one of them obviously has a star in it. Same with Ruby. And, like, it's, it's the sentiment that... You know, eyes, eye, eyes, eyes, and Aqua's eyes and Ruby's eyes just sparkle or have like that glow to them, or they're just like so deep, and people just look into them and like, damn, they have really nice eyes. The actual star itself in their eyes is that real? Can people see that? Or like, is it just for the audience to make it, you know, stand out? Because if they can, <laughs> then like someone who's as, is as obsessed with it as Akane should have already seen that damn Aqua has this same weird thing in his eye and nobody else on the fucking planet apart from one dead person one other girl has this I feel like she would have figured it out 
or she should have figured it out. But then this thing at the end, it's like, no, these aren't contacts. These just appeared. So it's just got to be like the vibe of it, I suppose. Like you are in that character and it, you just, to us, basically, I feel like it's just an audience indicator thing. I'm going really in depth with it right now. It's like an audience indicator thing. Like you either related or you're like acting a lot like that person like Akane is doing right now. Uh, but yeah, I'm really happy that Akane is back on it now and she's managed to secure a space back on the show. This whole misunderstanding has been kind of covered and hopefully now her presence, her online presence, her acting, acting presence will be better from here on in. But yeah, really good episode. Akane is kind of creepy with her research and stuff. But uh, yeah, let's see how it goes. Let's see if Aqua's like uncomfortable with this or not. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.